Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to customize your app icons on your iPad as well as how to hide your old app icons. So I did do this video a while back on iPad, but then we didn't have iPadOS 15, which added the app library, which is this little area right here. So this area, if you tap on it, you'll see your app library. So you can easily hide apps that you don't want on your home screen. Um, but yeah, first off, I'm just going to quickly show you guys how to create your custom app icon. And then I'll show you guys how to actually hide an app. So what you'll need to customize your app icons is this app here, which is Shortcuts. So this app is a default Apple app. Um, if you don't have it on your device, you can just get it from the app store, it's free, um, but it is an Apple app, so you're going to need that. And then you're just going to need your custom app icons. As you can see, I have a folder here in my Photos app with all the app icons that I've created. I just used Canva to create these, but you can get a bunch online. Um, it's just everywhere nowadays, so you can just search on Pinterest or on Google, whatever, for app icons if you don't want to make your own. There really are a ton. I do have some custom ones on my website if you want to check that out, I'll have a link in the description box below um, if you're interested in checking those out, but um, yeah, these are just the ones I made, but um, yeah, okay, so that's what you'll need as well, so so far we just have the shortcuts app and our photos for our app icons. So let's go into the shortcuts app here, and as you can see I already have a bunch of shortcuts here that I've created on my iPhone, it just comes over to your iPad. Um, but yeah, that's what I have for my iPhone here. And what you do basically is you click on the plus button up here, click on that, and then we're going to create basically a automation or a step-by-step -step guide as to what the device has to do um, in order to open that app. So what you're going to do is you're just going to click on this action here, click open app. If you, it has, doesn't give you this option here, then just search here for open app and it will come up as you can see. But I'm pretty sure it's going to give you this option. Click on open app and then here we're going to go ahead and click on app here and select which app we want it to open. So I'm going to say YouTube. Click on that and then we're just going to go ahead and click on this share option here. Click on add to home screen and here we're going to name our, our app. So as you can see apps here have names so this is just basically what you're going to have at the bottom of your app icon. So I'm just going to write YouTube here. I'm going to do it in this um, spaced way. I don't know really how to explain it. Just making a space between each letter. Okay. And to actually add the custom app icon, um, you're going to click on this option here. Click on this little block. Click on choose photo or if your app icons are in your files app, just select choose files. But I'm going to click on choose photo and then I'm going to select my app icon that I want. So this is for YouTube. Click on that. Click on use and then click on add. So now if I go to my home screen, here you can see our app icon. I'm just going to move it to its own screen here. So this is my app icon. So I'm just going to quickly go through it again to show you guys. So you're in Siri shortcuts. You're going to click on the plus button here. Click open app. Choose the app you want to open. For this one, I'm going to say Photoshop. Click on the share button up here. Select add to home screen. Title your app, add your app icon by clicking on this little block here, choose photo, select your icon in photos, click use, and then click on add up here. So now I'm just going to do that for all my app icons. And once you're finished customizing your app icons, you can add a few widgets and things like that and just have your iPad look nice and aesthetic or whatever. So these are just the app icons that I want to show you guys. But now let's get to actually hiding the apps. So the reason you want to hide your apps mostly is because you have YouTube right here, but you also have YouTube right here and you just want one YouTube on your home screen. So what you do is you go into the edit mode, so just long press on your screen anywhere until it goes into this editing mode. Click on the minus button here and don't click on delete app, just click on remove from home screen. So if you do that, it will just remove it from the home screen. It will still be here in your app library. Here you can see YouTube is still on your device. You don't want to delete the device. Otherwise, your shortcut won't work because YouTube isn't on your iPad. So yeah, just do that. Hide your app. So once again, go into edit mode here. Hold on, press. Click on the minus button in the corner and just click remove from home screen. And once you've done that, you'll see if you cut, tap on your app here, you can still go in. No problem at all. But yeah, that is how you 
customize your app icons on your iPad and hide the apps from your home screen. So I hope this helped you guys. Um, like I said, I did do this video a while back, um, but I got a lot of questions on I don't have to actually hide the apps um, but since that's a new feature with iPadOS 15. Um, so yeah, I really hope this helped you guys. And remember to go check out all the other app icons that I have on my website. Again, link in the description box below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Definitely don't forget to subscribe, click on the playlist to see all of my other iPad related videos, and click on the video to my previously uploaded video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!